Shadow and Shadows kind of was in the. I'm trying to remember now. It was actually in the the early summer of 2022 um, when it started to come together. If I remember correctly, it came to me kind of in a an image or in a thought in my mind of like imagining my daughter like looking up to the moon and just imagining like her like a genuine reaction to seeing the beauty of the moon. Um, and I feel like, you know, when you see the moon, you're you're always seeing like maybe just a part of it. Sometimes, of course, there's the full moon, but it can be very mysterious in a way looking at the moon. And I feel like perhaps in some way that's symbolic of our life, that it is mysterious and it, it can be beautiful. And sometimes you only see parts of our life and sometimes we can see the full the fullness of it but often we're looking for um at parts of it um and, and maybe in some way that's the beauty of it that we're always constructing and making so those are kind of some original thought this image of uh, my younger daughter looking up to the moon yeah i think one reminder for me looking at things through children's eyes is they notice these tiniest things and find beauty in them, which really struck me, like noticing a tiny leaf on the pavement in the city where we'll stop walking to where we're going and like pick it up and look at it. To me, that's that's so amazing. You know, somebody like me, at least at my age, will probably just walk by it right away. But they find beauty in these smaller elements that are often um, overlooked. So it just got me thinking about things from another perspective. Um, you know, we've been working on these projects before um, or, or before, you know, she, she was born, but I think that it opened up my eyes to other things, kind of like we're seeing through the eyes of a child. Like, um, even if you don't have a child, I still think we can imagine looking through a, children, a, a child's eyes with a, Maybe there's a sense of purity in the way they see things uh, and which allows them maybe to see more than we might actually be seeing ourselves.